Hey sis, they, girl. I'm sorry y'all, she got an attitude. Look, they trying to talk to you sis, so. Hey ladies, it's your girl Chi, and today is my first YouTube video in five years. I'm so excited, I can't even contain it. And today's video is a simple, Get ready with me. I did my makeup and my hair for y'all today. And also I mentioned later in the video that I will be having a Make Lash giveaway. So just make sure if you wanna be eligible for this giveaway that you subscribe and then comment down below in the comments what kind of videos you would like me to do. Thank you guys so much. Um, I hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Bye. The Fenty Beauty Primer. And that's what I'm using first. So I'm just gonna prime my face with that. <laughs> If it's Fenty, I want it, okay? A little bit of color corrector goes a long way, so keep that in mind. Because if you do too much, it'll like peek through your foundation and... I'm just gonna squirt that onto the back of my hand. I'm gonna put that all over my face, fuck. Ugh, the mouth, I'm so sorry. Believe it or not, y'all, all this time that I wasn't on YouTube, I wasn't wearing makeup. I stopped, I was literally not wearing anything, like no foundation. I'm not even gonna lie, my skin was popping. No foundation, no, no concealer, like nothing. All I did was some eyeliner, brows, and some lashes, but it was just like, when I tell you I was not all that into makeup anymore, I really wasn't. I like didn't watch YouTube videos, like nothing. So, when I, I quit making YouTube videos, I didn't quit, I just stopped. I never really thought I was gonna quit, but I, I kinda did. But I stopped making YouTube videos, um, I think it was my senior year of high school. Senior, maybe my junior going into senior year. And then I went to college. I live in Atlanta and I go to Georgia State University. And yeah, like a little timeline. I came freshman year, I was going to start making YouTube videos again. And then I lost my dad. And yeah, I just, I don't really know. Like it wasn't like that was the reason why I stopped or I didn't want to make videos anymore. I just, didn't even think about it anymore. Like it just really wasn't on my mind. Hold up, make sure that foundation is blended. Honey. All right. But yeah, it really just wasn't on my mind to make YouTube videos. So I just really kind of didn't think about it again. And then there was like a time where everybody was making YouTube videos. So I just kind of was kind of over it. And I, when I, I kid you not, I probably didn't watch YouTube videos for like two years. Um, it's 2018 now so I feel like two years I would I only popped in when I like started doing my own hair and making wigs and stuff I would pop in and like watch like if I needed to know how to do something that's when I would watch YouTube videos besides that nope no videos I completely quit cold turkey but like when I tell y'all now I'm kind of like obsessed with watching YouTube videos now okay well I'm gonna be using this Saint Laurent uh, concealer I like it if you guys are wondering I don't really uh, have too many dark areas that I want to cover I just have like uh, a little bit of acne scarring I just was not making videos and or not thinking about making videos I just started watching again and believe it or not, <laughs> what I really started watching first, y'all, y'all are gonna think I'm weird because my, all my family and friends think I'm weird for this. I love watching mukbangs. Love it. I'm just gonna blend this out with my beauty blender. And all my family and friends are like, you're so weird. Why do you wanna watch people eat? Like, I don't know. I love it. I love watching mukbangs and honestly, I might make some on this channel, so let me know in the comments if you're cool with it. <laughs> Using my spoolie brush and brushing them out. I'm gonna fill them in. So yeah, I'm using the Anastasia. I can't even show y'all this. It's that deep. I'm getting all the products, all of it. <laughs> and ignore my nails. I'm supposed to get them done today.
Um, I really haven't even been doing much this past five years. I just graduated from high school. I'm about to graduate from college. If you're wondering, I go to Georgia State University and I live in Atlanta now. So I, the past four years I've been living in the city. And I love it. I love Atlanta, honestly. It's just, it's so lit. But yeah, I didn't really do much, you know. I just went to class and did school stuff, college things. Dated a bunch of assholes. Um, made good friends, lost a few friends. You know how life goes. Had a few jobs. I worked at Publix. I worked at Taco Mac. I worked at Abercrombie & Fitch. I was a waitress at a strip club. And I got some stories if y'all ever want story time. Um, and a lot of people actually don't know that. So I really just said it on YouTube. <laughs> Nobody really knows. <laughs> but your girl was making real good money. I'm not even going to lie. That's like some of the best money I've ever made in my life. But yeah. And now I'm a nanny. Look at that. Switch up. y'all think I'm just gonna clean up underneath and this is the Maybelline fit me concealer so these are the brows and this one looks better than that one but hey it happens sisters not twins I like, I like to bake you know I like to bake or whatever it's cool so that's what I'm about to do but yeah, guys, like, I'm not even gonna lie, I feel really weird, like, talking like this, but um, when I tell y'all, when I was in high school, y'all don't even know, YouTube was really my escape, like, I loved YouTube, I grew to really love all of y'all who, like, subscribed to me, so y'all were, like, more like my friends, I remember I had girls who would, like, when there's a, I don't know if the feature is still here, because I honestly haven't checked, but, like when you could comment on people's channels. I had girls who were so supportive and so nice. <laughs> and I just used to be like, oh, I wish I knew them in person. And now I'm going to be using this powder by Black Opal um, eye where I put that concealer. Let's go ahead and uh, wipe this all away. See, look, y'all, I really was not trying to go nowhere. I mean, I had plans today with this dude, but you know when you just be tired of niggas? Like, at the moment, I'm just tired of these niggas. Like, they're so aggy. So annoying. Maybelline Fit Me Powder, which I, drugstore, like, this is, like, one of the best powders I've ever used. I used to wear when I... Once again, Fenty, like I said, we love Rihanna. We stand Rihanna over here. And once again, you think the Beauty Blender has done enough? No, we're gonna use the end that we didn't use and we're gonna contour. And don't think I, I wash, I actually wash my Beauty Blender before I use it. So don't think I'll be out here just, you know, putting this on my face. I literally wash it every time before I use it. Ooh. Ooh, sis. Okay, so eyeliner. I like a cat eye, but usually I just They're the only ones who know I'm doing this channel. I don't want to tell anybody who I like my social media or anything. I'm not saying like it's a problem or anything, but you know, I'm just starting it out. And you know, like a lot of people really aren't wishing you well. I'm not saying like I'm I'm arrogant or like I I'm not saying that I think so highly of myself, but but I do. I'm confident. But like a lot of people truly are not wishing you well out here. Don't tell anybody your plans. Don't, you know, speak something too early. Like, just keep it on the down low until you're ready to come out with it. Then come out with it. Did I tell y'all I started a hair company? I did, didn't I? Did I say that? I told y'all I make wigs. I make wigs and I also started a hair company and lash company. So for the lashes, my lashes, these are uh, called Blessed. 
from the Sochi collection. And I love my lashes. Everything within my line and my business is good quality. Not even good quality, great quality. And I, as a matter of fact, I, I shore of it. Cause I already know, like I've been wearing weave and well, well weave, I didn't start wearing lashes till like college, but I was wearing weave out here and spending a lot of money. This is just the lash glue I use, it's hair bonding glue. I, I learned this when I was working at the strip club. <laughs> it's like, I know how it, it was for me when I was buying expensive hair and getting disappointed and stuff like that. It's not cool, you know? If you're gonna spend your hard earned money, get what you want. I was over here, out here getting played, y'all. All these Instagram girls, I remember I bought hair from um, white label hair. Oh my goodness. That was like the worst hair I've ever had in my life. And I'm mad because, because I got it because, and this just shows you marketing. Instagram, Jerrica, Young Thug's girlfriend. I loved her hair, loved it, loved it, loved it. And she was always tagging white label hair. My dumb, my dumb self. Not even realizing like she was getting paid to wear the hair. But yeah, like it was so annoying. I was so annoyed y'all, that was like, because before then, my mom would buy my hair from um, this lady who used to sell hair. And she would just come to her daycare and like, she she had her kid at her daycare and she also sold hair. So that's what I was buying my hair from. And I tell y'all, that was some of the best hair I've ever worn in my life. It was so I've always worn good quality hair. So it was such a wake up call for me when I came to school and I ordered that hair and now I was, I was the girl who was wearing bad weave. I never had experienced that, ever. Y'all know, like if you, if you watch my old channel too, like I was, they were sending me hair and stuff. Like I've always had good hair. So I was sad, I was so sad. I was like, man, this white label hair is like some pack weave. Like, come on now. It was so tangled. I remember one day it was super tangled in class. I was so embarrassed untangling it. And of course, I was sitting in the front. It was windy that day. So I came to class. It was so tangled. I was late. So like all the seats I had to sit in the front and I just remember like untangling it. And I was so embarrassed. I was thinking about the people in the back who were watching me like untangle it. And I was just like, ah. Oh. I'm so embarrassed, like, it's not good. Not good. So that was like another reason why. But I really didn't start my business until I got out of my toxic relationship. But like, it was already in my head to, you know, just sell my own hair. Um, you know, like when you put on the powder, you be cakey. Mm -mm, we're not doing that. So, this is Mario Badasco's Rose Water. I know everybody. I really like blush. I think it's just pretty. So, I'm just using a pink blush, and it's from Maybelline. So, these are the lashes I have on. Aren't they so cute? Sorry. <laughs> And this highlighter is from Becca, of course. It's really cute. I love this highlighter. Um, it's Champagne Pop. And that's the highlight. A little bit of gloss. This is my favorite, all time favorite lip gloss. It's the NYX Butter Gloss, my favorite formula, my favorite everything, honestly. I really like this lip gloss. And then I'm gonna put the Fenty, of course. Fenty Beauty, sponsor sponsor me! No, I'm kidding. I'm not. Sponsor the girl, I have all y'all stuff. I really, I just like Rihanna. So I knew I wasn't gonna be disappointed by her makeup. That lingerie though, that was another, that was something else. I was not feeling that. But yeah, so this is the look. This is the face. Oh, I'm just going to, I'm like really oily and when I go out, I become even more oily. So what I'm gonna do is use the Fenty Beauty and this is their blotting powder. When I tell y'all, if 
if you're kind if you're an oily girl this stuff right here is so worth it it's for you i'm gonna set my face with the urban decay uh the slick makeup setting spray it's this stuff and i'll be still all day all right so now onto the hair let me move her over here hey sis they girl i'm sorry y'all she got an attitude look they trying to talk to you sis so so this is the wig that i made it's a closure wig and i hope you guys can see it's a closure wig that i kind of customized to look like a frontal it's super flat and this hair is the platinum blonde hair from the sochi collection and as you can see the hair is so nice but i wore this the other night funny story at the night i wore this i was looking so good got so many compliments me and my girls end up getting kicked out the bar of course but yeah this is the wig i'm just showing you guys how pretty it is the body and i'm just gonna freshen the curls a little bit and then i'll put it on um what i have on right now is a wig too under this bonnet but yeah i'm just gonna curl it real quick and i'll be back Okay, but I'm done. And that's all, folks. So